The story always has to relate in some way emotionally to uh, the characters that are in it. I mean, we want it to resonate in some way with them, with what's going on in their lives or what's going on with someone they love or care about, so it's not just a story because that generally tends to feel more like a procedural. Well, with any script, you know, someone comes into the room with an idea, like, like let's do a black and white episode. Ah! Ah! Mikey, you're in black and white. You are in black and white. I am not. Ah! Well, <laughs> let me start by saying this. Um, interesting that you should say paint because ideas come to me in colors. <laughs> Um, starting... He has nothing to do with how the scripts are done. Uh, we do all that in L.A. He's very good at saying them out loud. We know when we're breaking a story who's writing it, which is, which is great, and a lot of writers' rooms don't get that luxury. Uh, eight to ten writers sit in a room, and we figure out what the story's going to be. How do we tell the story? What are the interesting things about it? What are the obstacles? What gets in the way of what they need to do? Who has the artifact? All those nuances and, and details. And then um, a writer will go off and put together a beat sheet based on everything we talked about. And then we'll go through that. Beat sheet. <laughs> oh my God, I'm with, I'm with a monkey. Um, <laughs> don't touch yourself, we're on camera. The outline is 15 pages versus taking the time to go write a 50 page script. Then the studio gives notes and then it gets sent to the network. The network will have notes. The writer will do a first draft of the script and just like with the outline, it goes to the writer's room again. So there's always notes and things you need to incorporate and change. The writing staff always always chimes in on everybody's script and outline, and then I'll tend to do a pass or two on it before it goes to production draft. And it goes to the studio, and the studio will give notes. And uh, then I'll do a joke pass on it for, for Eddie, so he's uh, even funnier than uh, he was in the first pass. Joke pass. A joke pass, for, an Eddie pass. And, uh, and it's all pass to make it sound like me. Grumble, and, grumble, grumble. Everybody go away. Uh, and, a, and a hip pass for Claudia. And a gay pass for Steve. Oh, boo-hoo, Nancy Drew. Hello. It's all these passes we do on the script. And then the network has notes. And then uh, it goes to production. And then a lot happens in the script based on production, right? Where we, what locations we can go to, what locations are available. You know, we can't get a parking lot. It has to be a golf course. Okay, so it's a golf course now. And then uh, we shoot it. And that's when he takes over. Well, how do you do it, the rest of that? <laughs> Oh, here I go. It's gonna be great. And then on the stage, you know, scripts change a lot too. We'll we'll punch up scenes in the moment. Um, a line won't feel right, or we'll come up with a better joke, or or Eddie will pitch me a, a joke that's that's better than we have on the page, and we'll we'll go in that direction. You know, this is how it goes. Jack, I was thinking about saying this. And he'll go, mm, no, but say this. <laughs> And that might work. And then I'll go, oh, OK, yeah, that, may, that works. It's hard to imagine how they're going to do all this stuff uh, on the page, but they do. And we end the episode. Thank you. There's only three things you need to know as an actor if you're in the, the school of fart acting. It's who farted, you farted, I farted. And who farted is So who farted is? And then you farted is? And I farted is? <laughs> See, I was, I was going the whole different way. You I was went doing, for shame and yeah, I went for pride. For pride. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. a whole different, yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> different actors, different, different ways of looking at things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all you have to know. You can play any part. Jack came to uh, us and said, okay, now this next episode, you guys need to start taking Spanish lessons because the whole episode occurs within a telenovela, a Spanish telenovela. It's real? Estoy en la telenovela. So um, we started taking Spanish lessons. We've been learning Spanish whenever we can, like on turnarounds or between setups. Buenos dias. Como esta? Donde esta la biblioteca? <gasps> it's one thing, like, you know, to be like, hola, mucho gusto. Uh, you know, como estas? Donde esta la biblioteca? <laughs> and I, and I, I was all proud of myself, and Jack's like, mmm, okay, but you need to be able to say it like this. So for two months, I was, you know, you have to make sure that your inflection is right. <laughs> Santa enchilada! Yo hablo espanol! 
It's hard to act in English, let alone a different language. So I'm, I'm, a, I'm scared, but we'll see. Estoy hablando español. I mean, it's one of the things that excited me about coming to work at this on this job was that they, this group of actors are very, their range is very broad. They can do comedy, they can do drama, they can, they can, they can do melodrama. And I ended up playing um, Pete in a telenovela, Armando in the telenovela, and Pete playing Armando <laughs> in the telenovela. So there were three distinct yeah. characters within that, and they, and I mean. And that, a mustache. And a mustache. Oi! She slapped the <gasps> mustache right off I'm me. Sorry. I'm sorry. I wanted to do a really good job for Jack and for, for everybody. I worked harder on that episode than any of the other episodes, and I'll tell you, I think it paid off. They're all playing these big soap opera moves and these, these you know, big, you know, bold choices, and they all worked. It was physical, and it was written well, and it was directed well, and it was acted well, and I just was so proud of it. And I just shared a moment with my boss, you know, with my friend, my boss, my mentor. He really is. He just, I'm so in awe of how brilliant he is. And I was honored to have been given a chance to, uh, to be a part of that.